Okay, so um, we're looking at forming and solving quadratics. We're given this question, essentially, initially. So show that. So they've given us the answer. We've got to get to it. All right, now we've got a trapezium here. You um, In the olden days on GCSE, this used to be at the front, but it is no longer. On our GCSE, it is at the front, but here we go, half a plus b, they're the two parallel sides, h. That's what was um, given for the area of a trapezium. So we're going to use that. And I'm going to do a half, and I'm going to do x plus 1 is one of the parallel sides, plus x plus 7. All right, they're the two parallel sides added up, and then multiplied by x minus 3. Okay, so let's simplify that. Oh, sorry, and we know that's equal to 20 here. Okay, so um, add that up uh, and simplify, so we've got... 2x plus 8, um, x minus 3 equals 20. Now, whilst I realise that um, this here, okay, is um, is uh, even, so I could divide that by 2, that isn't always the case. So what I'm going to actually do is um, get rid of the half by multiplying everything by 2. So we've got 2x plus 8. Uh, oops, didn't close my bracket. There we go equals 40. Now if I expand those brackets and simplify, I'm probably going to have to go up the top. Actually I could fit a tiny bit more in down there. If I expand and simplify the brackets and then bring this 40 over to the other side to make it equal to 0, I get um, 2x squared uh, minus, uh, sorry, plus 2x minus 64 equals 0 and if you halve all of that you get what they ask you for there. Now for the second part, all right, all I've got to do is essentially solve this quadratic equation. Now it won't factorise. Um, it's it, yeah, it, it's not a particularly nice one. So therefore, we're going to use the quadratic formula. Now be careful with the um, signs here, okay? Because if you don't get the signs correct, then and actually I should put all of that in all of that in brackets. Um, it's a good habit to get into to put into brackets. Um, there you go, so minus one plus or minus the square root of uh, one squared minus four times one times minus thirty two or negative thirty two. Stick that all in your calculator and it says to two decimal places, so x equals uh, what is it five point one eight. Okay, so there you go. Now, key things to remember here is when it's a show that it basically you've uh, got to, they've given you the answer, you've got to find it. All right, so you, you're using other mathematical properties. In this case, area, it could be volume, it could be anything you like. All right, um, once you've got that, you don't particularly, if you don't get the show that bit, you can still answer the question. It's how they tend to write them. So you can't lose marks twice. So if you don't get A, you know, that messes up B, basically, messes up your chances for B. That that doesn't tend to happen. But show that means, here's the answer, how did we get it?